Live at five, coming to you from sunny Las Vegas. And we've got some uh, important information about the strike pass. Well, we've got some halfway information. We don't really know how much it costs or what's going to be. You know, a lot of people are speculating that maybe uh, Silver Surfer is going to be in this or Polaris. We don't know, man. We don't know anything about what the rewards are going to be and how much it's going to cost. But there's a, this is coming tomorrow. And it's going to go live one hour before server reset. So when I shoot this live on Twitch, that is at 5 o'clock Pacific time. So uh, this uh, strike pass will go live one hour before uh, server reset. And there's going to be a short uh, maintenance. I'm going to guess that that's going to be like 30 minutes or so. But here's the thing. Uh, it says right here that uh, when this thing goes live... You, know, you can uh, st your daily objectives will start contributing. So my suggestion is uh, when your account resets, and so my account resets for me, I don't know if it's at midnight or one o'clock. I haven't figured out since the time change, uh, but it resets in the middle of the night. And uh, save your daily objectives until tomorrow. And I just want to point something out. That is awesome for me and everybody else that can take advantage of that. Uh, so I can do my daily objectives, just I won't collect them, right? I won't collect them, and then I'll start, I'll get a head start tomorrow. Except for people in that magical time zone in the UK where account reset happens at the exact same time as this. Oh, they did, yeah, they got screwed because then they won't be able to do this little trick that I'm talking about because uh, they won't be able to, to, to withhold them because it'll happen all at the same time. I don't know, man. I feel bad. It's actually a thing um, that it happens. It's in the UK. Uh, anyways, let's go to offer review. We have an amazing 10 for 10. And I got to give say thank you, Scopely, very much for a fantastic silver promotion credit. My goodness, 10 for 10. Yeah, this is a no-brainer right there. 10 cores for 10 silver promotion credits. Yes, we're going to do it. I just want to say I also very much like this anniversary 2021 three-star draft. 100 shards of either Yo-Yo, Zemo, or Mr. Sinister. All three of those characters, in my opinion, are quite fantastic. Quite amazing. Uh, I don't need to buy this, but I think um, if you want to unlock a character, I believe you'll be able to unlock all three of these. I, I'm not off the top of my head. I believe you can unlock all three of them with three stars with 100 shards. I'm not. Don't know for sure, but it seems that way. But anyways, yeah, I, I think this is a great deal for 10 bucks myself. Uh, I don't need to buy myself, but anyways, let's uh, move on. Uh, what do we got here? Okay, we got something interesting. We're a training package. Let's add this up. Okay, so what we got here is we've got a training materials. I to value those at $2 a piece. We've got a premium orb, which I value at a buck. Is this a Moon Knight orb? Second chance? I value those about three bucks. We got $6, $1, $3. I value that at five cents. You know what? I, I have a deficiency. I actually am um, going through my second run of Dark Dimension 4, and I have a ton of gold. Plus, they gave us 3.33 million on the other day. I have a pretty extreme deficiency on training materials right now. So, I'm going to pick this up because uh, it's a, it's not a great deal, but I think it's more is they, 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 they met me on the right day and the right time when I needed training materials. I've been on the mark, on the lookout for a training materials offer. So I'm gonna pick that up. I don't think it's a an, a, a an exceptional offer. I think it's an okay offer. Nothing fantastic, but we're gonna do that today uh, for 10 bucks and we're gonna go away, go with that. Okay, let's, let's move on. Thank you. Okay, let's move on. What do we got here? I am Groot offer. All right, well, I, I don't know. I, I kind of feel like this should be $2 for 50 Groot. But, you know, 50 Groot shards for five bucks is fine. But I, I kind of do feel like Groot should be a buck. I kind of feel like this offer should be two bucks. Uh, do what you got to do. I'm, I don't need it, of course. So we're going to move on. Uh, power up your superior gear. Okay, my problem with all gold gear in general. In fact, you can go into... There's hidden offers right now where you can buy like uh, 100 isomers. Those are the origin pieces for bios for like 30 bucks for 100 of these. I kind of feel like the problem with all the gold gear is that it's not the same with purple gear. Purple gear, you need X amount, like 350 
SBCs and then or 350 ABCs to go to max level. And then you need, so that's purple, right? 350. Then you got to go for uh, SBCs, the gold gear to max level. It might be 2000. I, I, you need to like five to eight times more of these. It's almost like you got to drop a zero off of this. It's like, would you buy 12 of these for 20 bucks? No, it's just they added extra zeros on the end of these SBCs to make it crazy. I don't like it. I think it's a scam. It's trash. All right. Resource offer. I do like this offer. If you're pushing to get your 16 characters done for Dark Dimension 4, this will allow you to buy uh, gear 15 pieces in the war store and uh, do that war currency event that is running right now for the three-year celebration. So this is fine. I don't need it, but let's move on. I do not like this at all. Uh, we've got, uh, I don't know, more than about a week left on this event. I don't see there's any reason to even consider this offer until the last day or two of the event. Do not buy this. I just think it's a bad idea. Uh, blitz harder and you don't need to do this. Anyways, extraordinary energy bundle. So here's the thing is that this 2000 energy, which has a value of about $10 in itself, is worth a little bit more right now because you will get 2000 of this currency by spending the energy. And then you also, War Currency, that's probably worth about five bucks. You got another Second Chance Iron, that's worth three bucks. You got a Premium Orb, that's worth about a buck. Anyways, this stuff is worth st about $20. Uh, I don't know, I didn't check the event tab, but I think we're probably having a, an event tomorrow. I'm guessing there's an event tomorrow. We just had the, the 3X, but uh, check the event tab. And if you want to take advantage of any kind of double drops or if you're pushing to level 80, I think this is quite fine. Let's move on. Resource offer, not a fan. Let's just move on past that. All right, and silver promotion credit offer. This is a an average offer. Uh, this right here is 10 silver promotion credits for $3 is the same as 50 silver promotion credits for $15, which I don't ever buy. I do buy this when it has 50 silver promotion credits for $3, but I do think a lot of people pick this up anyways. All right, let's move on. Premium ISO 8 offer, not in the market for ISO 8. I am in the market for ions, and yes, I have bought this many a times. I was talking to a, a fellow guild mate, and he told me the same thing, that he picks this up whenever he sees it. My goodness, we need ions. Ions is the true bottleneck on this ISO 8. Uh, uh, absolutely. Let's move on. Heroic deal again. Uh, I like the other one a little bit better than this because I like the other res uh, rewards with it, but if you're pushing for level 80 or trying to take advantage of some sort of double drops, I get it. Let's move on. Uh, premium orb pack. Uh, not a fan of this. I, find, I value both of these orbs at a buck a piece. So we got premium orbs at a buck. Kingpin orbs at a buck. So that's a total of 14 orbs. It's not worth $25. There's $14 value there. Limited time sale. Nothing fantastic about this. At best, gold orbs are worth two bucks a piece. That's $8. Another two bucks adds up to $10. No, we're not going to buy that. Let's move on. Orb draft. Guppy snack, as uh, Goofy would call it. Premium orb, a buck. Gold orb, two bucks. Ability orb, which is this watermelon orb here, 10 cents. 14 basic orbs worth about 90 cents to me. Uh, I'm not gonna buy this because I would be very upset if I pulled a ability orb for, for a buck. Power core deal, I do like this deal. I, I would be more interested in this if it had 225 power cores, so that way you'd be getting the training materials for free. But overall, I do like this deal. Let's move on. Pack of Shane, get out of my face. And super savings, uh, not a fan of that offer. Any of these offers here, they're just kind of there. And everything else down here is trash. Now, uh, right here we have 200, uh, we have a gold orb for two bucks, premium orb for three bucks, and that is $6 worth of cores. That's a no go. And then I, if I have to go, I, I wish I would have checked the events tab before I started offer review, but if there's a special event tomorrow, I might pick this up right before a uh, server reset. So, you know, when, you know, when 22 hours has gone by, if there's a special double drops event running after a reset tomorrow, I just have to check the events tab. This right here is not as good as the 50s, refreshing campaign energy for 50s, but it is better than, if you, than doing the 100s. So if you're a person that does the 100s, I think this is a good deal. Uh, but I do the 50s, so I'll wait. There's some times where I'll do it uh, when uh, there's double drops or something like that. Anyways, let's skip over to my other account and see what we got going on over there. Again, 10 for 10, we're gonna pick that up on this account for sure. All right, we're gonna keep going. I do like that. We're gonna scroll past all of the duplicate offers. We're gonna look for the unique offers that sometimes show up on this account. 
All right. Yeah, we talked about this. Okay. So we got comic tricks. We will talk about both these offers in the same same breath. Is that Hella and Loki are villain mystic controllers. So uh, five villain mystic controllers at six stars helps unlock Phoenix because Loki and Hella are as guardians. They unlock Black Bolt and Black Bolt unlocks Ebony Ma. I get it. And, uh, and I, you know, do what you got to do on these. But uh, in a lot of ways, Hella, not only being an amazing character herself, uh, she's very useful in a lot of different ways, but also she is the pathway to three legendary characters, Black Bolt, Ebony Ma, and then Phoenix. So do what you got to do. Kind of pricey, but, uh, you know, getting Hella is kind of um, a normal progression for a lot of people uh, to get a lot of good legendary characters. Let's move on. And there's Thor, and Thor's great early game, mid game, late game. I, I find he's best right now with uh, in Wave One Avengers, but he can go between Wave One Avengers and As Guardians. Do what you got to do. All right, let's see what else we got. Um, I don't see anything else. Um, I'm kind of disappointed with the post today, uh, with you know the strike pass. Not really having any more details, uh, but we will be here tomorrow on Twitch. So one hour before server reset, you know, the game will go down. I'll be live when the game's down uh, and we will be doing goofy stuff. And we're going to see if we're going to be the master beta testers for the strike pass. I don't think the strike pass is going to be bugged out, though. It seems like it's pretty straightforward. We've already have the other one. All right, guys, thanks for watching and keep on gaming. Double ISO drop tomorrow. So I was right. There's an event for tomorrow. Save your energy for double ISO event. ISO tomorrow. Save your energy.